Hi, it's Matt here from Cub Campers. This week on Camper Tips, we're going to be talking about changing a tyre. Now, for some of you, it's a no-brainer. But for others who are a little unsure, let me run you through it. OK, so you've just pulled over because you've noticed you've got a flat on the camper. Your first step should be to make sure you are pulled right off the track away from danger, but also on a level, sturdy surface. You can, from here, assess the tyre to see if it's able to be repaired using a plug kit or if it needs to be replaced. If it does need to be replaced, drop your trailer stabiliser legs and lower them until they just touch the ground. Now grab your vehicle's jack and position it underneath the trailer's axle or suspension arm. On this particular camper with independent suspension, I'm using the flat surface under the stub axle. Before you raise the vehicle off the ground, remember to loosen the wheel nuts on the tyre you are changing. You must remember to do this while the tyre is still on the ground. This is also a good time to get your spare unloaded so it's sitting next to you ready to go. Once you are ready, raise the jack until the wheel is sitting off the ground. Then remove the wheel nuts and swap over to the spare tyre. Now it's a matter of tightening up the wheel nuts. Now I like to start with the one at the top, then the bottom, to make sure the actual wheel is flush against the hub. Lower the jack so the tyre hits the ground and the weight is taken again by the wheel. Then tighten the nuts again. Torque the nuts up to 125 newton metres, ideally with a torque wrench. Lastly, raise your stabiliser leg and you're good to go. Now it's a really good tip, check your wheel nuts after about 15 or 20 minutes of driving. For more tips on your camper trailer, visit the Camper Trailer Lifestyle website or on our range of campers, cubcampers.com.au.